Hi, this is Sally at Who's the Mummy, and here's a tour of the Lacta Parentis campsite in Biscarros. The first thing you'll see as you come into the campsite is the bike hire store. This is open every day, and for a few euros, you can hire a bike. On the other side of the entrance, you'll find the reception. This is open daily and has free Wi Fi. Next to there, you'll find the small grocery store, which stocks all the basics that you would expect. There's also a restaurant and bar on the side. It's fairly formal, you often need reservations, but they also sell takeaway pizza. The next public building is the entertainment area, or Sal the Spectacle. Um, there's entertainment nightly at the campsite, often geared towards children, and it might be discos or games or challenges. It's quite a large space with a big screen, and they, uh, when we were there they played video games on the big screen. The entertainment space backs onto the pool complex, which I think is one of the real highlights of this campsite. As you'll see, it's a really big, generous space. Um, on the side nearest to the restaurant, there's a really big toddler play area with lots of splash zones, and it's safely fenced off from the main area of the pool with the slides and the deeper water. We found that there were plenty of areas to sit and shady umbrellas. On the far side of the pool, there's an on-site spa, which offers a range of beauty treatments and massages while you're staying at the campsite. The restaurant also has a patio area that overlooks the pool. Um, this area of seating is a really nice spot to have a drink in the afternoons, although do be aware the campsite restaurant isn't open all day. If the weather's not great, there's also an inside pool. This is heated and has some small slides and jets, and the kids found it to be great fun. As you can see, the overall pool complex is really large. There are five water slides, which our older children really enjoy. And right next to the swimming pool complex is this playground, which has a jumpy inflatable castle and a pirate ship. In high season, there's also a snack bar here with a picnic area so that you can sit next to the playground. Again, for days when the weather isn't so great, there's a games room. This has some video games, pinball, air hockey, table football, and pool. These uh, machines are to be paid for, and it's a couple of euros per time. Most of the accommodation on the site is at the back of the pool. I'll just give you a really quick glimpse of this area, but if you'd like to see more detail, then watch our next video for inside the accommodation. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.